Hey everyone, Foxy here. Uh, this week I wanted to show you guys archaeology. The uh, weekly class, well actually it's every two weeks. Uh, my whole purpose is that I found after doing it for quite a f some time that it's not really worth doing. So I'm trying to get these out like as soon as possible so people don't waste their time. Um, last week's was actually, I think was worth it. I picked up this key and it, as it says, it says, uh, visit a time lost version of the NAR, I can't read words, I'm sorry, the Academy, which basically takes you back in time. No, nope, wrong one. I was going to the wrong one. Uh, you go up to this Academy here. You go all the way down inside, uh, where you typically draw the runes, that world quest, uh, and it puts you back into where all the mages were alive and I fought I believe the headmistress I was able to get her down pretty easy she's a little bit of a challenge you just kind of got to pay attention and I earned the title headmistress I think it was worth it a lot of people don't but it's a title not everybody has so let's see where this week's going to take us there she is She's always doing something. Hello. Carrying books. Quest that I send him more survey equipment, but I just don't have the time. Would you be a deer and take this crate to him? Okay. Good Where are they sending us? Ah, well, Sharar. Ah, darn it. The invasion's going on. Well, that's okay. We'll be all right. And as you can see, I picked up the new mount. It's actually pretty cool. Comes with a companion who's kind of worth the money, but it's totally up to you. And you can buy it with WoW Gold. It's to you. It, um, as for said, it does change color. Uh, when we get in the air, it probably will. Um, I haven't paid attention to the timing on it, but... Oh, there it goes. Yeah, it's a pretty pink. It's got beautiful wings. Blizzard has outdone themselves. It makes me think of uh, Wizard of Oz, the horse of a different color. Good luck, friend. Archaeology isn't very hard to get up if you just want to start it. You actually get a point for each time you dig, and you're constantly digging one site for it. I've never actually counted it, but uh, you do get a little bar that tells you when you're done. And uh, for Legion, it's Demonic, High Mountain Torrin, Highborn. Yep, that's all four we have for Legion. Um, I have not done the others. The only ones I've been working on is Troll because I heard you get them out. Um, each one you solve, you get one of these, and it turns into a little crate, which you can turn back into the trainer, and you can get um, little orders to for whatever you want. It'll go towards your fragment points. Uh, I don't know a heck of a whole lot about it. I It's just, you know, one of the secondaries. And I just added my little mission to try to get them all up. See, I only have uh, fishing left to do, which is a pain. Oh, and uh, of course, my enchanting, but that's a different thing. They used to, uh, when it first dropped, they used to have a whole... The burning legion is a plague that sickens the land with its presence. The demons must be purged before their forces spread any further. Thank you for interrupting me, Scenarius. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, they used to have a red area on your map to show the whole outline of the survey area. Um, and it also shows on the mini-map the little shovels. That's where you survey at. But they uh, omitted that for some reason. I actually enjoyed it. But let's head off to him and... Have opened a portal to bring forth more of their accursed kin. Destroy their infestation before the forest is overrun. Sorry, that's gonna get annoying. And depending on where you're gonna be surveying, there will be enemies from time to time. And depending on what you're doing, 
you can end up with a lot of mats, like the bear steak, fur, stuff like that. Um, if you're a skinner, that'd be a good idea. I can feel it. The Purple Hills of McGee. Combine 40 pages into one chapter. Oh, they're starting to repeat now. I remember this. This is like the first one I did. Well, we'll see. Um, it does vary from time to time. It's basically luck, what you pick up out of the ground. So we'll head to our first dig site. I will do my best to keep talking during this because it, it does get tedious and boring. Uh, with archaeology being a two-week thing, you don't have to do it right in the beginning. The rewards have never been super duper cool. Um, I remember one was decent relics, which were, I think, account bound, so you could send it to your alt. But I haven't really seen one that was like... Well, I, I take that back. Um, I did one in Suramar where it gave me a... Oh, was it? It was something to sell that was worth, I think, 15k or something like that. It, it was decent. It was a while ago is what I remember. Um, all you need to do to survey is have your little shovel and just click it. This little spyglass will pair up and all you have to do is follow it. And when you get close to the node, a little thing will appear above your head. It's a little shovel, I believe. Yep, little shovel. And you also get a second little buff there that shows you. Oop, that's not the button I want. That's a big bear. And it's over here. And we're working with Demonic this week. Right click it, pick it up, and we already got three pages. But we're gonna need to combine 40 pages for one chapter. So it'll be a little while. Um, I typically stay in the same area and hit the shovel again and just keep following along. And your, uh, when you do solve, you do, um, <coughs> excuse me, like I told you, you do get the, uh, they create the little chests. Uh, you do have a chance to get a rare uh, item. And that goes on the shelf and where the archaeology lady is. And I believe you get a couple gold for it or whatever, but it, it's kind of neat. Um, when I finish this, I'll go show you guys my shelf. I haven't gotten too many, but... Well, it seems like we've been getting pages every dig. Well, that's good. Uh, you will never have a dig in water. I don't know why I'm running through here. I can just fly, but... Um, you can do this on your mount, but I don't 100% recommend it. Because you can overshot the node really fast, and you wouldn't know. And of course... Of course, I had to do this during the invasion, but it'll be over here soon. Ooh, and these are keystones. What you do with them, I usually wait to use them when I'm full, and you just put them in the little holes, and it gives you more fragments. So it just adds up to it. Uh, you can sell these on the auction house. Uh, on my server, they don't sell very well. Uh, the price does go up on them, depending on which weekly it is. Um, I've seen, depending on the High Mountain West, High Mountain has sold a lot because it's a pain in the ass. Uh, one of the High Mountain archaeology is you've got to collect the keystones. And they're not super rare, but they're not super easy to get either. So I guess if you wanted to be lazy, you could just buy them. Um, I'm pretty sure most people by now did do the high mountain at one point with their archaeology because we all got the moose mount, which was pretty fun and easy, but I just kept up with it just to see because not a lot of people know what the quests are going to bring you. It's really a guess. I know I've said I've done this one before. I don't know if the reward's going to be the same. It's been so long. I don't know if they're just repeating now or what. But we will find out. I'm sure once I do it, I'll remember. Uh, I do remember 
one weekly gave me a pet. I don't remember who he was. It was one of the, uh, those red, uh, gremlin looking guys. Uh, the same guys they use to, uh, when they added in that secret cow level. Remember, they would pop up randomly and you have to kill them in time and they drop coins and crap. Yeah, it's, uh, one of them. If I knew the proper name for it, I would tell you what in the world. That makes no sense. I have never had... Okay, I am a big liar, evidently. I have never had a node pop up in water like that. That is so strange. Huh. Well, I apologize for that. Jeez. I look like a big fat liar right there. And when in doubt, if you think you've gone too far, just hit the survey. You can hit it as many times as you want. Uh, when I first did it. Ooh, what's that? Oh, and you do have a chance to pick up some art artifact power. And we're up to 35 pages out of 40. Um, I do believe it stems out more, but I can't quite remember. Uh, let's go ahead and go up here. From time to time... These little shovels will appear gold. Um, it basically means that it's a high-risk area. Um, higher enemies and so forth. I always figured it was higher risk, higher reward, but that never... That never panned out for me. Gotta keep an eye on your map and land in the right area. Uh, it will not let you survey if you're not in a surveying area. So that's a good indicator. Like I said, I missed the uh, red area on your map. And this is probably going to get annoying. But that's okay. Uh, go again. I forgot which way I was going. Forward. Three more. See, it's very easy to overshot them. And I'm just walking. Alright, we got our 40. Oh, I figured it was going to be more. Combine nine chapters into the Purple Hills of Mickery. Mickery, yeah, that's it. So, we're going to have to make 40 pages nine times. I, uh, I'm not good at math in my head, so you guys could figure that out. Uh, but the pages aren't hard to come by, thankfully. There are harder ones to get. Like, I believe there was a Suramar one that you had to get fragments of this crystal, and they took forever to dig up. Like I said, it does get tedious, but it's a nice little change. Don't really want to do much or just want to get a little bit of mats. And it's not a hard thing to upgrade at all. I mean, I'm completely capped, but like I said, each dig gives you a point. And you're going to be getting digging an awful lot. I started at zero. And I was 800 before I even knew it. Ah! Look at that, you can get lucky sometimes. <laughs> Do -do -do. It's a good time to take in the scenery, listen to the ambience. You're just chatting with a friend, you know, or waiting, even waiting on a queue for something. Gives you something to do, instead of just sitting around or Getting tired of the world crest grind with artifact power and all that. But it really is a uh, profession of chance. It really is. I have not gotten. Whoop. I 
I have not gotten any of the mounts that archaeology offers. I don't know if I'm just not doing it right or if it's just, oopsie, I went too far out and won't let me do it. Um, I guess, what was I saying? I haven't gotten any of the mounts. I don't know if I'm not doing it right or if it really is throughout the solving. I haven't really looked it up. Might as well pick up, you know, the lean shank there. It's part of cooking. Cooking's a secondary as well. It's something to do, you know, and you do get achievements, you know. It's not like you don't. Ooh. Ooh, this is awesome. Oh, this is the... This is the pet I was telling you about. I mean, this isn't, but um, you can pick up these from time to time. And these guys will also show up randomly when you're surveying. And they just give you extra fragments. Um, they're not always looking just like him. Uh, Suramar, I believe, is like a uh, spirit. Uh, High Mountain is Fallen Torin. See, he gave us extra stuff. And we're up to another chapter. Um... Um, let's go ahead, because I'm not going to be able to count. We're up to two. We need a few more. And I believe we finished this area. So, let's head off to the next one. Thankfully, it's close. Um, after each one you do, they do reset in a different area. So, there's never any wait time for anything like that. Uh, you do bounce back and forth through the same area a few times, and that does get old, but... I sense a foul force within Braden's Brook, hero. Search for Legion presence and destroy it. Thank you, Cenarius. Cenarius, excuse me. Oh, this is going to be fun. All right. It's going to be a fun area to deal with. Ooh. Here he comes. That's what I thought. This is beneath me. And of course, I get stuck down here. Drop. Jeez. So they just let you down. Ah, it's gonna be a pain area, I already know. I need to target something first. But gotta do it. Oh, what's that? Oh, cool. It's also is a good way if you're missing recipes for um, area drops. You never know, because you are going to be fighting stuff. Could get lucky. Um, even the littlest chance of a legendary drop. You know? You never you never know. I've had legendaries drop off enemies. Well, it only happened once, but I've had it happen. Jeez, how far is this area? And you're going to keep chasing me and bugging me. Oh, look, we picked up another one of these guys. Awesome. Seventeen pages, not bad. Oh, look, raid team one. They finally got a heroic mistress down. <laughs> oh, and maiden, wow. Hopefully my team can get them next week. We're still learning, unfortunately. We're a pretty good team, though. We really are. We have a lot of fun. Here comes the bird. Yeah, that's what I thought. Two of them, look at that. Um, I typically do have my void walker out, but he does get in the way. But these guys aren't that hard to deal with. Where did you pop out of, dude? I don't have a target. Sure, he wasn't attacking me, but the minute I moved, he would have. I guarantee you. Hopefully we'll be done with this area soon. Oh, look at that thing. Let's ho hold on a minute. 
I don't remember seeing that thing. I've been here I don't know how many times. I've seen him, but I've never seen him. Look at that. It's cool looking. Here he comes. Let's see if he drops anything good. Ah, barely enough. He's pretty cool looking though. Very neat. Yep, too far out of the area. Okay. Okay, enough with my little detour there. I just, I've never seen that creature before. I guess I've never really paid that much attention. And of course, like I said, the invasion is still going on. So he probably pops up during then. Where are we at? Oh, another chapter. Cool. Almost there. At least it's going rather quickly. I do not know if it has anything to do with the level of your archaeology. Because I remember when I last did this, it took forever. <laughs> and I was pretty low. But... I can't carry any more of those. Oh, we are full. So that means it's time to solve. Go to your demonic. I'm going to go ahead and use these. Might as well. Got one. Two. And three of them. And all you do is right click them. And it'll create your crate. And you just turn them into her. Or you can sell them for the one goal, but... So totally up to you. I turn them into her. My personal reasons. Trying to get the troll mount. I could be completely doing it wrong, but... Soulbound, yeah, that's what I thought. Pretty sure those things could go for a lot on the auction house if they weren't soulbound. Okay, one or two more digs, and we should be done with this stupid area. And of course, I overshoot it. All right, we're done with this area. Uh, um, I don't want to fly all that way, so we're gonna go back down. Let's see. Almost there. Hopefully it doesn't got me sitting in the PvP area. No, we're with the harpy-ish ladies. Eh, another fun area, but not, not as bad. Does that? Oop, got it. And we got another one of these. Steam pages for that, not bad. And she's gonna attack us, might as well get her first. Eh, any little bit of money helps. Everybody likes money. So, um... Today, it's, uh, what is today? Oh, it's August 3rd. And the creators, not cre yeah, the, what is his name? Ian. He did another live Q&A today. And from what my husband told me, they are going to be getting rid of the uh, quest line that I'm opens up your third relic. I need to target something first. I don't know how I feel about that. They're calling it a uh, catch-up mechanism, which is fine. I don't know if they're just giving it to people now. Or if they're getting rid of the third relic. I, I doubt it, because that makes no sense. But it's just like, man. Stuff we all already freaking did. But um, 
I see why they're doing it. They're going to be completely changing up the relic system. Come the next patch. Uh, I haven't looked too much into the new patch. I know the relics are completely different. They have like their own little talent trees in a way. I, I mean, I could, I have the wrong word, but it's kind of like that system. I did see a picture of it and it branched off from one relic and all that. Uh, of course, she's gonna take me right to her. I do think it's cute when they add those little mechanics. I believe, oh, oh, what dungeon is it in? Let me look real fast. Not the Arcway. Oh, Court. Court of Stars. I think one of the bosses, as you do that, jump to not get stunned or whatever. All right. I'll finish with this area. Where are we up to? Ooh, 70. Oh, I wasn't even paying attention. Ah, not enough. I forgot it was 40. Okay, and we're up to four chapters. We need nine. Almost there. I'm going to try to find this chest. Might as well. Okay. Meh. <laughs> Nothing too spectacular. Um, I'm... Oh. me how gross I'm going to take the flight master and get out of this area I'm gonna go ahead and go back up here I don't feel like going here again right now oh there's the golden area I was telling you about um actually let's go over there next just cuz I, did, I, I didn't even see that over there I was wondering why it was boring yeah we'll go over here believe that little island that's got a lot of murlocs. It's a little bit of a flight, but hey, might as well. Maybe we'll get something really good over there, I doubt it, but. much new going on here. I'm still sitting at 918. We've been working hard. Alright, need to go up this way a little bit more. Yeah, it's full of murlocs. Uh, I've no time for eh, they're not too bad. I know they got some elite stuff here. But like, uh, eh, still not too bad. I think it's just because there's so many of them and they respawn so fast, so the higher risk area. More like higher annoying, but <laughs> at least those two were fighting each other. Hey, I never scoff at gold. It adds up. Over time, it really does. You know what? Let's see. Since I've started playing, I've only earned two gold or one gold. Oh. <laughs> oh, never mind. I was going to say, you never know. It can add up. But of course, I haven't really done much. Just been doing this, and most enemies I killed don't drop gold. Okay. Four. Hopefully, this won't be too long here. Wow, looks like they're in the same spot. I ain't complaining. Quite interesting. Swimming we will go. And he's gonna pinch me. Yep. Another one. Pinch. 
sure I'm still going the right direction. No, I wasn't. It can it can really it can change directions and you won't even know. I think the first day I tried it, archaeology, I kept just clicking the survey. I had no clue you're supposed to follow the spyglass. I just kept clicking it. I walk like two steps and then I'd click it again. It took a very long time until I'm like, oh. I never noticed the thing above my head. It's just a little pet peeve of mine, but I always finish an area if I, um, more than likely, I'm going to complete the book here before, like in the middle of an area. I don't just, I don't stop. You might as well just complete the area. You're almost done. It doesn't take long and you can build your fragments up. That way you get more crates if that's what you want to do. But back to when I was talking about the Moose Mountain, High Mountain. Uh, that's all I did all day long was pretty much digging holes. That's what we're doing is digging holes. And I, pre yeah, I spent all day. You had to pick up these bone fragments and you got maybe two at a time. And you had to get a lot of them. I think it was like a couple hundred you need to get if I'm not mistaken. Ooh, what's that? Ah, we're out of our car. Not much, but it's something. All right, we're going to take Flight Master, and I'm going to go up here. Change of scenery. Uh, we should be getting close. At least half done, hopefully. Let's see. I've got 63 pages. Put me up five. There's four more chapters to go. Oh, and I do remember. Now I knew it. Now I remember. Another uh, weekly quest. I believe it's in Suramar. It gives you something to obliterate. Um, I can't remember how much obliterum is worth. But if that's something you're looking into, um, I'm currently stocking up on it. Because the item levels are going to change come patch time. And of course, obliterum's going to... Hopefully, maybe. I'm not telling you, telling you to. But obliterum might skyrocket in the auction house. I mean, it's still pretty good selling now, but I'm just going to hang on to it. It always sells, so it doesn't hurt to hang on to it. I clicked on the wrong thing. Well, no, that's as close as I was going to get. That's fine. What's just the 44 minutes? All right. Facing the right way. Up this way. Near the dungeon. So there'll be some annoying enemies too, but or that's the raid. Sorry. Using my colors today. Ah, it's been a while since I've been in em Emerald Nightmare. I, I really liked it. I enjoyed the raid. Why? I don't know. I just I thought it was kind of cool. It was simple to learn the mechanics, and it didn't take me long to progress through it. Ah! Of course I did that. Go figure, I knew I'd do it. I need to target something first. Oh, this way. Okay. Ooh, the stinky water. Of course, if you're doing this on a low-level character, it can be very frustrating. But I do really enjoy the 
the ketchup mechanism they did for most, well, not most, for all of the, um, what am I looking for? Professions. You can just start them right in Legion. You don't have to travel back and forth, unless you really want to. Um, for my cooking, I did go back to Warlords. It's just because the, um, every recipe I made was worth more there. So you may end up having to travel, but for archaeology, I didn't have to travel at all. Uh, enchanting, I didn't have to travel. Uh, I've always been a tailor, so I was completely capped for Legion. And I'm pretty sure tailoring's the same way. Mining is the same. You stay here. Which is pretty nice if you ask me. Do I mean how it can get a little annoying, but you do pick up mats, like I'm picking up cloth, and I'm a tailor, so I can make stuff and obliterate it if I want, or sell it, and all that good stuff. That was the wall, so. That's how I judge it, is I, if I feel like I've gone too far, I do it again. And nine times out of ten, I have. Can't carry any more of those. Oh, we're full again. Any more? Oh, I got five. Wow. That's not what I want to grab. Have that not bad. Bags around here. I'll pick up some more. I don't think. No. Okay. You fill up pretty fast if you don't, you know, pay attention to it. Here he comes, <laughs> stomping his way over here. Oh, up! Oh, I shot him anyway. I guess he. Wouldn't have got me if I didn't shoot him. Oh well. Which way? <laughs> uh, just the little things they add in there. I just heard him a stomping. Whoop. Too far. Oh, uh, where are we at? Uh, we can make another one. Three more. We're almost there. All right. We. Ah. Ah. Landed right on top of it. Give up. There is no hope for this world. I must have cut myself at work or something. My finger has a cut in it and it hurts. Don't remember doing that or what I even cut it on. Through the water again, jeez. Finally, we're done with this area. Uh, can't fill another one. Uh, where are we gonna head up next? Oh! Just fly down here. Here. 
or right here. Ah, how lucky can you get? I wasn't paying attention, I'm sorry. Uh, see what I mean? They can just pop up out of nowhere. And it is nice, they give you extra stuff, so... Oh, he blew up. Yep, they, they do different things from time to time. He gave me, I don't know how many different things. Awesome. Uh, three or four. Go around the rock. Oh. Another one. Two more. <laughs> Love when that happens. Oh my goodness. It can go pretty quick if you get lucky. It's all random generation. Like everything through this darn expansion. Which isn't horrible, but it's just, ugh. area. I can't do another one just yet. Oh. Uh, let's go back down here. I don't want to go right back up there again. I don't want to go the other area yet either. Where did I want to go? Okay, over here to the temple. You know what I mean? How they repeat, like, we were just here, we were just there. <laughs> but if you're looking to get through quickly, if you're right on top of it, go ahead and do it again, but I'm gonna do a little change of scenery. These darn trees get in the dang way. Alright, should be good here. Of course, right through the Inquisitor. This stupid eyeball. I hate those things. And they die so over dramatically. Oh, there he is. Ooh, 19, wow. Oh, one more, guys. We're at the home run stretch. Probably finish this area and we'll be good. Go back to. I think his name's Brom. Anyway, we'll go back to the quest giver and either he's going to give us our reward or he's going to send us to do more crap. I can't carry any more of those. We're full again. Have any? No, I don't. Only two this time. The 
bear is going to get me. I might as well get him first. Just over there. Let's go nab it. Yeah, water resources. Oh wow, look at that. Cool. 161 gold, not bad. Well, I guess if you really wanted to, if uh, you were a Manx Bear, you could use it for transmog, but I don't know about that one. Almost, almost. Um, I think I should be able to clear this area and be completely done. Got two more digs. We'll be done. There we go. A little lucky. Depends on how many pages he decides to give me. But I think we'll make it. Let's see. Okay. Last one. Yep, we are full. Good, good. All right, let's. Oh, stupid me. Find the nine chapters. Okay, let's head back to him and see what's next. Hopefully we're finished. If not, hopefully it won't take much longer. I think this should be it. They don't typically send you back a million different times. Not that I'm aware of or remember anyway. These trees. There he is. Lord yep, his name's Bron. I was right. Are within our grasp. Oh, we're gonna get uh, 40 million artifact power. Not Keep horrible. Alright, we're gonna go to where he wants us to go. Let's see, anything specific in a final chapter. Oh, man. Oh, shit, I forgot about this. Well, well, I'm going to keep it off screen. Um, all you got to do is go through Dark Heart Thicket. And you'll be able to pick it up through one of the bosses. Um, I can't remember which one, but it'll tell you when you get in there. So it's $40 million for artifact power. Eh, just depends on where you're at with your weapon. But $40 million's not really anything to me right now. I'm at, uh, when I pop back through, I'll tell you where I'm at. But I'm in the billions. I mean, it's a good chunk for most people, but not really for me. Uh, let's see, where am I at? 4.2 billion, so 40 million is not really a big chunk. I'll do it later. Um, I don't think you guys want to sit here and wait for me to be queued into a damn dungeon. <laughs> but I will show you... Here is where your rare artifacts will pop up. Well, I guess I got more than I think. Uh, looks like I'm just missing one from these shelves. Uh, when you do get it, you get a quest. Uh, it'll pop up on one of these shelves. All you gotta do is click on it, and it sits here. So, archaeology isn't too bad. Um, as for um, the question, was it worth it this week? It's more of, depending on where your character at is at. It wasn't really 100% worth it for me, but Artifact 
Pyro's Artifact Power. That's 40 less I gotta grind through World Quest. So I um, hope you guys will check it out, and I wish you happy hunting. Bye!